Hello and welcome back to another place. We're doing the life and because it's awesome. Pistol cranial trauma system. Medkit. That is something I wanted. Uh oh. What was that? That sounds Looks dangerous. Like the door's power supply has been cut. I'm seeing the trouble spots out there. We could send this repair drone. We'll need to escort it. Unfortunately, the drone is damaged and is on reserve power. Let's make it quick then. Seriously? Ah. Not the sound I wanted to hear. One repair done. One to go. You gotta hold on a little longer. Understood. Oh, crap. Is this designed to teach me how to do these kinds of missions? I really hope that's not the case. There we go. Alright. Could be what? Oh shit. Where am I being shot from? Over there, alright. What? Banshee? Are we serious here? Alright, it's dead. Ah. Good thing I have that bombing pistol, I guess. God damn it. Ah. Poor Edie, that must have been traumatic to uh being killed by a banshee. Ah. All right. The darkness can be breached. That artifact, it, it's like in Bryson's office. Move, I've got a shot. Turn back. Garneau. What the hell? Was that the Leviathan? Shepard, over here. What have you got? That was not Garneau. This is. It appears he's been dead for a while. So, Leviathan can have Bryson killed, can take over this colony? And he can use them as puppets. Huh. Anything else useful? Encrypted data and a personal log with eight missed calls from a 
Dr. Anne Bryson. Anne Bryson? Bryson's daughter, I guess. Who, who are you? What are you doing here? I'm Commander Shepard. Are you alright? I think so. I feel like... I feel strange, but... Alright. Do you recognize this man? I've never seen him before in my life. Someone here killed him. Someone here? How is that possible? I'm so sorry. Can you tell me anything about what happened to you? Not really. I, uh, remember... It just seemed cold. I remember a, a feeling... Cold and dark. If dark was a feeling, that's exactly what I felt. That artifact, do you know where it came from? It came out of the mine. Right. Head office was supposed to send someone. That's about all I can... Cortez, what's your situation? Can you bring the shuttle? Affirmative. Strangest thing. A couple of minutes ago, the Reaper forces broke off and left. Reaper? What's a Reaper? What year do you think this is? 2176. 2176 was ten years ago. What? Let's arrange for these people to be evacuated into temporary quarantine. That's a lot of time to lose. These people are in for a shock. Oh, crap. It now seems Leviathan not only has the power to destroy a Reaper, but possesses an indoctrination ability. Do you think it might be a Reaper? If it is a Reaper, then I want to know what it's up to. How long has it been out here? And more importantly, why? Edie, did we get anything from Gardo's notes? Yes. They suggest that Garno created a way to block the artifact's mind-affecting properties. The artifact... Why are you invisible? Agreed. When I head back to Bryson's office, I want you there. Yes, Commander. I want to know just what the hell these artifacts really why are. Why was she invisible? Do. They're powerful and dangerous. That's for sure. And we've got one sitting right in the middle of the citadel. That is not good. What did I do? Alright. This crucible project is intense. Bring the others on it around the clock. For sure I'll have to make a run for the citadel to pick up some equipment at the hospital. If you got time, want to meet me there? Thanks for crazy and galaxy. It'd be good to see you in a quieter place, you know. Hope to see you around, Jacob. You can match Shepard. Thank you again for all, the, all you did to get our group on, out of that facility on Galax. Admiral Hagen is an amazing man and it's a privilege to work on him. Construction of pro Crucible is presenting as challenges, but my team and I are determined to crack its mysteries. Though I never rely on luck, in this instance I feel we may need a little. Stay safe, Commander. I hope our paths cross again. Commander. Alright. This was creepy. We need to go back to the Citadel either way, but we just... You know, the Quarians have done pretty well with those suits. Maybe they can make something like that for you. Yeah, they have. Protective medical exoskeleton. I could even get one with racing stripes. So what's the problem? It's like walking around in heavy armor. It totally screws with my spatial awareness. I wear heavy armor, and my spatial awareness is perfect. Uh, you crashed the last shuttle, you flew Vega. <laughs> I need to feel my balance shift when I'm flying. I need to feel the ship moving with me. You take that away, and I don't know. I mean, I'm good, but I'm not me. Yeah, I get that. Leviathan's mental restraints are odd. My AI shackles served similar purposes. But why add sensations of darkness or cold? Auxiliary power units are depleted to 82.04% capacity. This should be corrected. Yeah, I'll get it before we go in atmosphere again. I will run a diagnostic on it. Edie, we've got five of them. According to the diagnostic, we now have four. 
Hello, Shepard. Commander. All right, you guys just do your thing then. Huh. That was weird. That was weird. Well, I guess we're going back to Zidal then. Oh, wait, wait, no, there was, uh, was, uh, things I needed to get. Which way was the, uh, mass relay? It's over there. Oh, make it to the mass relay, make it to the mass relay, make it to the mass relay. Come on, bro. Come on, you can make it. There we go. Right. Let's see. Hey, this Nexus. There we go. Fuel reactors. Oh, hey, fuel depot. Thank fuck. Let's go to Sion. It's a gun world. Great. All right, Javik. Let's get you to stretch your leg. Same goes for you, James. Hmm. Of Paul's rival. All oh, right, yeah, I gave him that, didn't I? When I wanted to make sure I had the right outcome for uh, Ranok, which is the Korians die, I had to redo Ranok entirely because that was the last save I had. So I had to bring someone with me, and this time I brought Javik just to get him to stretch his legs a bit. So, yeah. That's why he did. It was Ultimate Pole's rival. Interesting story, isn't it? Oh, let's see. Disciple could actually be interesting to give him. Did I get that recently too? I think that was really recently. All right. Give some damage. Can't uh, can't be bad either. Maybe something with a bit more, uh... Maybe give them both puzzle rifles, right? Why not? Uh... Uh... Right! It's be gonna be great! Um, Cinder Ramo. Yeah. What about you, Javik? Reach a speed or slam tag at five seconds. Reach a speed. There we go. Let's do this. Go kick ass! What happened to the troop station there? Unknown, but no fuel means no fleet presence in this theater. The enemy will operate unchecked. I need you to get in there, find out what's going on, and get those reactors back online. Captain Riley's on site doing preliminary recon. She leads one of our top engineering teams. We'll get to the bottom of this, Admiral. Good, hack it out. Maybe I should have brought someone with technical expertise. Commander, Corporal Nyrek reporting. Captain Riley is on point waiting for you. How long have you served in this outfit, Corporal? Three tours. Been through thick and thicker. The captain always sees us through. All right, I know this place. We 
on it, ma'am. Captain Riley? Commander, it's an honor. Commander, Captain Riley has me scanning the facility. It's a dual reactor system, so you'll have to break up into two teams. Roger that. The fuel rods for both reactors need to be unlocked before we can initiate a restart. Your route is blocked. Captain Riley's man is working to clear the obstacles. Understood, Lieutenant. Got it, Captain. Good work, Coslo. I'll take it from here. We're facing an unknown enemy here, Captain. If they're still on site, my team will help send them to hell. Ooh, sweet. Ready your team to hit reactor two, Captain. Got it. We'll cover you till you're clear. What are those? Directional guidance error. Team two moving out, Commander. Good luck, Captain. This place gives me the creeps. No more wait. Take the fight today. Just stay sharp, people. That's how it works. Spare parts. Or what? Oh, I guess we can't get down there. No, no, go up again. Oh, like that. Right. That should do it. I have a visual on the fuel rod control, but radiation is blocking access. Same situation here. I'll find a way to vent the area. This looks like ventilation control. Should do the trick. Radiation clearing. Console now accessible. Let's unlock those fuel rods. Oh, it's over there. Good. But yeah, this is a pretty normal level in a common level in mult multiplayer. I get it a lot. Interesting. Oh, those are nice to see, aren't they? Fucking husks. Good thing I brought Javik. Oh, 
ครับยูกัสกัดแอนนี่เกิดไอเดียสNo reasoning behind that, actually. So, hopefully, I made the right call. <laughs> Fucking broke. Yeah. What? But I'm tracking some movement toward the pickup point. Finalize the restart, then we can rendezvous there. Will do. Oh god, did I just kill off Javik? Extraction point. Did I just kill Javik? Ah, oh, gee. That would feel really meaningless. No, there you are. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Commander, you saved our asses. My team is in your debt. All right, Javik. Good job. Job well done. Report back to the shuttles. Ah, oh, crap. I really thought this mission was about to, to take like a horrible that turn. Depot, the entire theater would be at risk. What are the odds the Reapers will be back? I'm allocating a task force to maintain and defend the facility. If the Reapers come back, we'll be ready. I read Captain Raleigh's report. It says she and her team wouldn't have made it without you. I'm glad I could help. I'll keep you posted on new developments. Hack it out. All right, that went well. Okay. Thank you guys for watching this episode of Fire for Plays. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you join next time for more shenanigans. Until then, bye!